you guys, it's Leela. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna show you guys what I do to get ready in the morning for school. So as you guys can tell, back to school season is upon us. <sighs> I'm like not ready to go back. So I am notorious for sleeping in. I am notorious for being late to class. I am notorious for all of those things. Getting up in the morning is like my most dreaded thing. Getting ready is actually my most dreaded thing considering I actually like get ready on camera all the time, which is kind of weird. But I actually really hate to get ready, especially like when I don't have a purpose. Like for me, like school is not a purpose to get ready, like <laughs> by any means. But um, we all do still have to look a little bit glam. Sometimes I go to school without makeup, but a lot of the time I really try to look put together at least a little bit. That way my professors aren't like, who is this alien walking into my class I like to look like a human so I filmed this look it's actually a lot of items that are really affordable super cheap it's very quick um, it's not a lot of steps but that way you look a little bit more put together and alive and things like that and then I also show you guys my dry shampoo so you guys should stay tuned for that towards the end because um, it's literally my favorite product it's how my hair looks super voluptuous and volumized this is like fourth day hair guys and honestly it's only because of the dry shampoo that I use that it looks like decent so so yeah, I already did a five minute makeup challenge and you guys saw how that went. So this does take a little bit longer, but um, at least you look a little bit more put together and a little more alive. Also guys, I got my nails done finally three videos later with my trashed like missing nails like ratchet looking nails i finally got them done and i love the way they came out they're actually a little short for my taste usually but i figured why not do something different it came out so pretty and i love them anyways if you guys want to see how i got this look then just keep on watching open up you open This is Leela from the future. Please ignore that obnoxious fan in the background. I forgot to turn it off before I started filming, so I apologize. I bought this CoverGirl Clean Matte BB Cream. It's for oily skin, so that's me. I bought two shades. I bought uh, 530 Light Medium, and I bought 540 um, Medium. So I figured I would try these. I feel like I'm probably more medium since I am self-tanned. Let's put the cat ears on and let's get started. So the first thing I'm gonna do is prime my face. Obviously, I already moisturized. I'm so sorry if I have any redness on my face right now too. Like right here especially. I just got my eyebrows done. So my f I actually get my whole face done when I get my eyebrows threaded. So it's a little tender and a little red, but we put some aloe and some witch hazel. Girls feel a little less sensitive actually. This is the Wet n Wild Photo Focus Water Drop Primer. Um, they have it in the rose scent and the cucumber scent if you guys already watched my drugstore haul. Um, I mentioned it there because I actually bought it during that and I, I've been absolutely loving it. It's the only thing I reach for actually for primer so far. It's really silky on the skin. Also, if you haven't watched my drugstore haul, I will link it up in the little thingy right here. Click on the card, go watch it. It's really, really cool. I got a lot of good affordable makeup from Ulta the other day. That was really fun. Seeing my total at checkout, that was really fun. Let's see the BB cream. Let's try 540 first, and if it's too dark, then we'll go in with 530. Yeah, 540. So I'm gonna be taking um, this Real Techniques foundation brush. Um, it's just like a flat one, and I'm gonna put it, so BB cream on there, and I'm just gonna apply it all over my face. I'm gonna go in and buff this out with a sponge just because it did go on a little streaky with the brush. Let's go in and buff her out. You can already tell that it's like looking better. Okay, now I'm gonna go in with just a little bit of concealer, nothing crazy. Just because we still want it to look like more natural, more fresh faced, like that no makeup makeup. So we have our light coverage for our face. Now I'm gonna go in with my Milani Conceal and Perfect. Um, this is in the shade 135 Medium Beige. And I'm just gonna, usually I would like, you know, carve out my eyes and like my nose and all that. I'm just gonna literally dot it a little bit under my eyes, more so just to like cover any dark circles or, um, you know, any of that, just because, you know, your girl is gonna be up all night studying. And then I just wanna highlight and accentuate a couple of areas. So we're gonna do the chin, the nose, and the forehead, and then just blend, blend, blend. Now that we have concealer, 
I'm not gonna go super heavy in with powder, but I am gonna be taking my Wet n Wild Photo Focus translucent powder, and then I'm gonna be taking this like small tapered brush, and I'm just gonna focus the powder like right under my eyes. That way it's not like we're baking it super, super heavy. That way we can just control like where the setting powder is going, and you don't want your concealer to crease throughout your school day. So I'm just gonna pack it in and focus it right under the eyes. And that way we look awake while we're in class, <laughs> even though we might not be. Perfect. I'm just taking the excess onto the oily parts of my face, so like my T-zone, my upper lip. I really have to set my upper lip because your girl loves to have a sweat stash 24-7. And then I'm just gonna dust some on my eyelids so my eyelids don't crease. Now, I found this really cool set from e.l.f. <laughs> Be right back. Okay, anyways, like I was saying, I got this really cool set from e.l.f. It's a bronzing blush duo. So this is what it looks like. Really, really pretty colors. And this was only $4, guys. So for us college students that be balling on a budget, that's really, really good because super cheap you get both for the price of like like half the price of one usually so I'm gonna be taking this um, this brush right here it's a contouring brush and I'm gonna go into the bronzer first and then I'm gonna go in with the blush after and I'm really I'm not gonna like we're not gonna chisel our face out we're just gonna give ourselves a little bit of dimension because we're looking a little flat right now and we don't want to have a flat look of the face pick it up here a little bit a little bit down here they also had this in a few different shades, so I got the tannest one because your girl's real dark. They do have a couple other ones, and they had like a really nice like pinky, like light pink blush with like a more like cappuccino color for the bronzer. I thought it was really pretty. And then I'm going to go into the shade right here um, and then use that to give me some color we can look like a regular human not a struggling college student we don't want to go in too heavy with this guy because she's a little pigmented I'm gonna take a little bit on my forehead and a little bit on my nose just to give me some color so now I want to do a little bit of highlight just to you know brighten up the face let's do blossom glow this is really pretty I don't reach for this that much I always forget I have it looks like this it's super super pretty so we're gonna take some on our highlight brush and it's gonna be really, really light. Don't go too heavy-handed. Don't, you know, you don't want. We don't want to glow to the gods at school because we don't want to distract everybody from learning. See, it's very subtle, super pretty. Take a little bit under my brows. This is such a pretty color. I don't know why I don't use this more often. And then a little bit on our forehead, our chin. And then I'm gonna be taking this precision brush from Real Techniques. And I'm gonna actually go in and we're gonna put some in the inner corner of our eyes just so that we look more awake. This is a really good hack, guys, if you feel like you need to brighten up your eyes. Pop some highlight into the inner corner. Or if you feel like you're just doing like a basic, um, you know, wing liner or lashes, you feel like you just need a little, little extra, put some glitter in the inner corner whether it be like a color or like a gold or a silver put some chunky glitter or like a really pretty glitter color you have like in a palette pop it into the inner corner and i guarantee you it'll change the way your look looks by like a million it really really just adds that little bit of an extra pop if you need it i love putting a highlight Perfect. Now for brows. This is the only thing that's not drugstore, but I know that there's a drugstore brand that did this. So I don't know which one it is. I'm so sorry. But um, this is the Benefit Gimme Brow Fiber Gel. Basically what it is, is it's little fibers that are on the spoolie. And what you want to do is actually just focus this on the areas that you need a little bit more volume. So usually like right here, I'm a little sparse. So I kind of just use this to fill in that area and then I kind of just drag it through my brows so they look a little fuller and darker. So you guys see the difference? Like they just look done. 
and I was just like little swipes I love this stuff and it's actually not that bad I want to say it's like 24 probably had this for like six months and I'm like not even halfway done with it I remember in high school I used to use this all the time because I didn't know how to fill my brows or I felt like brow pencil brow pomade was just too much for me um so I actually used to just buy this instead and I used to fill in my eyebrows for school and I want to say I had to replace it every school year. It lasts a really, really long time. So it's kind of worth the investment if you don't ever really like doing your brows or you don't really have time in the morning. This is a super easy alternative. Okay, now we're going to do some lashes, but I'm not going to put actual lashes on. I'm just going to do mascara. And I am going to go in with my Dynamic Duo, which is going to be my Lash a Little from Maybelline and my Better Than Sex. I know that Better Than Sex is a <laughs> drugstore. I know, I'm sorry. Please don't roast me. But this one is, and this one's really nice. <laughs> that obnoxious noise that might have been in the back of this video, it was my fan. I totally forgot to turn it off before I started filming because it was so hot in my room. So that noise that you heard the entire time, I'm so sorry. But I turned it off. <laughs> I'm such a dodo. I told myself to turn it off and I didn't. Okay, and then we're gonna set our face with my Maybelline Make It Last um, setting spray because. Did I say Maybelline? I meant Milani. <laughs> coffee sometimes helps me, but coffee also makes me a scatterbrain. So I apologize. <laughs> um, but this is so that we can lock in our foundation or our, our face and that way it's not gonna move throughout the day we can go about our classes and everything and even maybe go out for a city date after and not have to worry about it so yeah cool face is done and the last thing because what is a no makeup makeup look without some lip gloss i went to target because you know your girl loves target and i ended up picking up these two NYX lip glosses. They're called Butter Glosses. And I feel like I've heard like other YouTubers talk about these. So I was like, why not? They were like $5. Ooh. I think I'm here for like that clear gloss moment. I'm gonna do that. Oh, these smell so good. Oh my gosh, this smells like cupcakes or like candy, I don't even know. I am so here for this. This is so cute. Oh my gosh. I love, wait, I kinda wanna try the other one too. So I decided I wanted to try the other color because I kept looking at the swatch on my hand and I was like, that looks so pretty. And I just feel like this will go so much better with this look. Yes. Oh my God, I love this color. Yeah. I like both of these a lot. I actually don't even know which one I feel like goes better with this look, but we're just gonna stick with this guy. Usually the last step I throw in my hair before I go to school, it's by Bumble and Bumble, and I'm not even gonna kid you guys, this is the best dry shampoo I've ever used in my whole life. This is like fourth day hair and watch. Like, do you guys see like that grease? I already did it like in the middle earlier. So you can kind of see like it looks more matted, but like you see how this is like really, really greasy. Watch this. And then you just rub it in. And it does show up white, but if you don't put a, if you don't put too much, you won't even see it. And you just have to rub it in. And look at that. It looks so clean. Like it looks like you just took a shower. And then the cool thing is that it actually has UV protectants in it. So it's actually gonna protect your hair from like the sun and things like that. I don't know about you guys, but I have an outdoor campus. So I'm outside a lot, especially like during my breaks and stuff. So this is really, really good to help protect your hair. And it smells really, really good. And look at that. It looks like I just took a shower. And it gives you a lot of volume too. Like you see how like it just looks like really voluptuous now. All of like the like oils that like were weighing down my hair kind of go away. So this is always a step when I am running late. Even if I don't do my face. This is like my like put together look. I If I don't have enough time I will just run out of the house. So um, this is the step though that I always do. And it's kind of pricey but this can 
is seven ounces seven and a half ounces and it's 47 dollars the one that's half this this size i think it's like 30 something and then they do have like a mini travel size that's like 12 dollars. that's how i tried it first i used that mini one i literally went through it so fast though because i used it so much because i fell in love with the product so i recommend getting the huge can because i usually go through my small bottle in like a couple of months but this guy is like two or three times as much and it's gonna last me that long but that's it for today's video guys thank you so much for watching good luck to everybody who's going back to school your girl's gonna be right there with you but i'm still gonna try to upload a lot of content for you guys so thanks again for watching if you like the video please leave a like subscribe to my channel hit that little bell you'll get a notification every time i post a new video and i will see you guys in my next one bye